Hey folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is for Mac users who use a USB webcam. Maybe you're doing Facebook or YouTube Live or you're doing FaceTime or you do Skype interviews for your podcast. If you use a webcam such as the Logitech C920 or other popular USB webcams, I want to introduce you to an app on the Apple App Store called Webcam Settings. Webcam Settings is $7.99 for a download and allows you to have full control over your webcam settings. Let me show you exactly how it works. So on your Mac desktop or laptop, you can go to the App Store by just clicking on the little app on the upper left and click App Store. Just do a search for webcam settings and this should show up. If you haven't purchased already, it's going to be $7.99. Just go ahead and buy that and it'll download to your computer. It's going to show up up here though in the menu bar. So the popular webcams like the Logitech C920, which is what I have here on my MacBook Pro, do a pretty good job in automatic mode of setting the right exposure and white balance. But with webcam settings, you can get to look exactly how you want it. You can control the brightness or the exposure. You can control how much contrast or saturation. And some cameras, it will, if it's compatible with the app, will allow you to zoom in or pan left and right so you can get multiple looks. So let me show you exactly how it works. So just go ahead and click on the camera up here in the menu bar. You want to make sure that the correct webcam is checked. Then just choose show webcam settings. So again, up here you want to make sure that the correct webcam is checked. And then right here you can just go through these. Manual exposure, you can change the volume if you want to actually change some volume of your webcam. But I don't suggest you use your webcam microphone anyways. But brightness, contrast, saturation, if I just move these sliders, you can see I get brighter. If I choose the contrast, I add more contrast. I can add saturation, and you can make this look really terrible as well. So you can just go through these and kind of get the look you want. Here's auto white balance now, but if I uncheck this, I can add it here to add a little coolness, or I can add more color. So if I want to get rid of it, if you make a total mess of this and you just want to get back to normal, you can come down here and just choose camera default, and it'll reset all the settings for you. So it's pretty easy like that. So here's focus. I would probably keep this checked at auto. You can zoom in and pan left. I can move it over here. I can pan right. So that's pretty cool. I can tilt up and down. So if you get a look that you want just like that, you can just go down here and you can save new profile. My test, hit save. And then when I come back the next time, I can either choose to load it every time or I can just select between the different looks of mine. So that is webcam settings, $7.99 from the Apple App Store. If you do have a webcam such as the Logitech C920, I highly recommend it to get that perfect look the next time you're doing a Skype interview for your podcast or a live Facebook Live or YouTube Live or the next time you're doing a tutorial. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.